We've been trying to figure out a way to cut the heating bill down. Um, so what I did is I actually pulled out my buddy heater. So there's my buddy heater there. Um, I purchased this a while ago. I actually purchased it for uh, out in the garage and actually at the cabin up north. Um, sometimes we don't like to use the wood burning stove, so I'll just uh, throw this on and it heats up the place pretty nice. But uh, the wife's been complaining over the last couple winters that it's cold. She likes to crank up the heat to about 75 or even higher sometimes. So what I did was to keep our heating bill low, I actually brought out this uh, buddy heater and uh, I actually got the big tank hooked up to it. You can uh, run the two small tanks, but it seems like the big tank lasts longer. And I get these tanks filled for about $10. Um, so it's pretty cheap. And I usually only run this for maybe two hours at night. And it'll last me about a week and a half, almost two weeks, because I don't have to run it on high the whole time. Um, this room, it's a decent sized room. But it's not enormous. And uh, down this hallway here is actually where the thermostat is. So right now it says 75. I put this on probably about a half hour ago and it was at 73. I actually have the heat turned off. And usually within, I'd say an hour to two hours, this house can get all the way up over 80 degrees. At least this floor right here. And each one of these doors are bedrooms here. So I just, I can crack those open. And uh, it heats up this floor pretty nice. There's my kitchen in there. And uh, just to be safe, I got one of these carbon monoxide sensors so that just in case, you know, there's any carbon monoxide in the air, it, uh, it'll go off. But as far as I know, this buddy heater actually has a low oxygen sensor in it. So if it senses that there's uh, low oxygen, it'll shut off itself. Also, if, it, if you tip it or knock it, it shuts it off. It shuts itself off. So you don't have to worry about uh, any accidents happening. Like I said, I've been using this for the last couple years, last two winters. I pulled it out again for this winter. And uh, it seems to be working pretty good for this size room. Uh, my house overall is about a little over a thousand square foot. And uh, like I said, this floor heats up pretty nice. And I actually have uh, high ceilings too. In all the rooms so I like it it's worked for me haven't had any problems the sensor over here for the carbon monoxide has never went off it's never even registered I actually have two on this floor alone besides the one on the table there got a uh, one in each bedroom so uh, just to be safe but uh Overall, it, it, it does a good job. It keeps my wife happy and the kids happy to heat up this room during the winter time. And it keeps me happy because my gas bill doesn't go up high. All right, guys, so real quick, I had the heater on, the buddy heater on, I'd say for about an hour. And it already kicked up the degrees on this floor. It's about 82 degrees. I just turned it off. It's getting kind of hot, but I just wanted to show you guys. All right, guys, here's a close-up real quick of the buddy heater this is the big buddy by mr heater and like i said in the sides here you actually can put one of these in there and then there's a spot on the other side that opens the same way you can put one in there it just doesn't seem like those last as long is the 20 pound barbecue uh, propane tank. So I actually bought the hose that fits in here and it screws into your propane tank. But this is what it looks like, pretty simple. It takes, I think four D batteries, flip this switch and there's a fan that comes on to circulate the air. And then here's your uh, dial for a high, medium and low. Alright guys, so if you're looking for an alternative to maybe heat up your uh, 
basement, maybe an outdoor room or a shed, a workshop or something, or possibly uh, a living room like I am, just to keep your heating bill low. This might be a option for you guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you guys found this video useful, hit that like button. If you guys like what I'm doing on my channel here, hit that subscription button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you guys get notified on my next video. Talk to you guys later. Bye. 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 Bye.